The following is a 15-man battle royal to determine the final two picks of the 2007 WWE Draft. Well, I cannot wait. This is an opportunity with SmackDown to really run away with this draft, John. It's every man for this himself. First, Matt Hardy, William Regal, Chavo Guerrero, Mark Henry, and Chris Masters, Team SmackDown. And unlike the last two presidents of this country, you can't avoid this draft. If, if the SmackDown uh, superstar is the last man standing, that means SmackDown will get two draft picks. The same for Raw and for ECW. I would pick Tori Wilson twice more. Just, just to make sure. Sure you would. Oh, I would. I'd pick her. Oh, would I pick her. Introducing next, Kevin Thorne, Matt Stryker, Marcus Corbon, Tommy Dreamer, and the Sandman, T-E-C-W. And a very eclectic group of ECW superstars. We've got two ECW originals with the Sandman and Tommy Dreamer, the alpha male Marcus Corbon and Matt Stryker of the New Breed, and Kevin Thorne, a former member of the New Breed who has no alliances to any of his teammates. Basically, whoever wins this thing is the last man standing, only one winner. I just hope it's an ECW guy. Love to pick up two more draft picks. Making their way to the ring, Johnny Nitro, Kenny Dykstra, Viscera, Yuji, and Randy Orton, Team Raw! But the assortment of Raw superstars coming to the ring now. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, this is not, I repeat, not a team battle royal. It is every man for himself. The uh, surviving member of the battle royal, the last man standing, will win two draft picks for their brand. To be eliminated, one must be thrown over the top rope. Both feet must touch the floor. So, JR, you won't necessarily see uh, much teamwork, perhaps, in this battle royal here tonight. I don't think so. Last man standing has got a chance to cash in some big chips. Eight draft picks have been made, and here they go. Here they go. I'd be interested to see Mark Henry and, and Big Biz hook it up. The two biggest men in this battle royal that generally favors the biggest men in the match. Well, Mark Henry, uh, JR, it's not just the biggest man, it's the world's strongest man. Which definitely would make him a favorite, JBL. I mean, for you guys, the SmackDown for sure. And you know what's interesting? You look at the ring, guys, and you see people like Chris Masters with a SmackDown shirt on. Yeah. Who, well, actually, he's part of the Raw roster when we went on the air tonight. It'll take him long to jump ship, didn't it? <laughs> Wanted to come to the major leagues. Matt Hardy's all bandaged up in the activities of the last couple of weeks. I saw Matt Hardy and his brother Jeff Blues. Oh, no! Oh, 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 oh. Matt Stryker is gone, and just like that, ECW is down to four representatives. Well, that's not good, but Sam Man and Marcus Corbin working on a world's strongest man along with some SmackDown brethren helping them. Well, that's the one place in this matchup you actually may see teamwork trying to get out the big men, Mark Henry and Vincent. Well, he's, uh, as JBL's point, I mean, he's got to be the favorite as the world's strongest man, Mark Henry. He's got to be the favorite, but you guys would agree for your own brand. I mean, get your ego out of it. You guys want to win as bad as we do. Oh, no, absolutely. Work has the team out there. I, you're right. I mean, you got to team up if you're Raw guys or, Sm or ECW uh, and, and get rid of Mark Henry and or Viscera. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, tonight on the first try branded draft, some big choices have been made. Draft choices I'm talking about. The great colleague going to SmackDown. Boogeyman going to ECW. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Thinking of ECW. There goes the Sandman. And now we're down only three representatives in ECW. And the odds are uh, looking great King Booker right has now. come to Raw. Chris Benoit to ECW, which is a great hey, hey, Oh, and There goes uh, William Regal from SmackDown. SmackDown's first elimination. SmackDown also got Tori hey, Wilson. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Talk about the world's strongest man. Oh, oh, man. one of his own teammates. Chavo Guerrero. Every man for himself, John. That gets us two draft picks, Michael. Well, you go tell him. You go talk to him. I've never gotten along with him. I think, uh, Cole, you should go tell him. No, oh, not at all. Oh, oh out goes Tommy Dreamer. Damn. Tommy Dreamer manhandled over the top rope, and Mark Henry is kind of the bull of the woods thus far in this uh, battle royal that has started with 15 men.
is certainly dwindling. Oh, oh. a lot of red shirts in there, JR, from the wrong team still. Well, we talked earlier about it. It's going to take a village to get the viscera out of that ring. You can't even fit into the t-shirt. <laughs> Things not looking good for ECW's Kevin Thorne right now as the world's strongest man, Mark Henry, has his sights set on the follower of vampirism. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. The ECW ranks are dwindling. All we've got left is the alpha male, Marcus Corvon. For ECW's sake, though, guys, if I had one guy to choose, it'd oh. be Marcus uh -oh. Corvon. Well, you know, you got, a, you got a monocle like the alpha male. Oh, no, I spoke too soon. Oh. Randy Orton just got a big headbutt right in the face that took him down. Remember the last... Oh, time. hey, hey, hey! Uh oh Here we go! King just looked at Kong. Oh. Godzilla and King Kong here. Oh. Oh. All we need is Steven Spielberg and Akimono. I think, I, he, think I, I saw a couple of molars. Yeah, I, I think he caught him in the jaw. <laughs> these, <laughs> I think you would define these as super heavyweights. Yeah. And if Mark Henry can uh, lift Visser over that top rope single-handedly, he is the world's strongest man. Well, if anybody can, it would be Mark Henry. And look at Big Viz trying to put the world's strongest man out of this competition. Somebody better help him. Remember, two draft picks are at stake, the final two of the night. For the last man standing, he'll earn it for his team. Oh, oh, man. That's the world's strongest clothesline. That's a slobber knocker if there ever was one. Mark calls himself the silverback, the king of the jungle. Look at, look at, look at. What a strength. Good Lord. Oh, Whoa. We did it. Mark Henry is a bull of the woods. Will he stay that way when we come back?